Hello again, and welcome to another Uncle Jeff's Easy Peasy English. Today, we're going to look at some prepositions, some prepositions of place. And in particular, today, two prepositions of place, below and under. We use below and under to say that something is at a different level to something else. For example, their apartment is below ours. You could also interchange it with under. Their apartment is under ours. Or, I keep the bleach under the sink. I keep the bleach below the sink. However, sometimes they are not interchangeable. Have a look at Uncle Jeff's board. OK, so we use below and not under when one thing is at a lower level or a lower point on a scale than something else. For example, look at these two sentences. Most of New Orleans is below sea level. Or, I'm sure the temperature is below zero tonight. And we use under and not below when one thing is covered by something else in some way. Look at these two ideas. The puppy likes to hide under the sofa. So the sofa is covering the puppy. Do you always wear a vest under your shirt? So the vest is hidden under the shirt, it's covered. So below and under. We can use underneath to emphasize covered by something. For example, I keep my money underneath my mattress. My money is completely covered. I keep my money underneath my mattress using this word for emphasis. So there we are. Prepositions of place, below and under. They are easy peasy. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time on Uncle Jeff's Easy Peasy English. Bye bye for now.